what I want to be remembered as is as a leader, a mentor, and an outstanding fighter pilot. My job as a commander is to support the people and to make sure they understand the importance of what they do. If I enable the people, they will take care of the mission. We have a lot of similarities with corporate businesses, but the fact is you're making a commitment that you will serve your country for a period of time. Room, Carry on, take your seats, please. In the military, everyone's familiar with our rank structure and our chain of command. I really look at it differently. I really see the commander and the command staff at the bottom of the organizational chart because we are the foundation, we are the support. I truly see diversity as a competitive advantage. What we really want to get after is that diversity of thought. If I have people around the table who think very differently, that have different backgrounds, we have diversity of thought around the table, then we're able to come to a better solution. It's going to take longer. There will be vastly different opinions, but we will get to a better solution in the end. One of my favorite techniques is something we call leadership by walking around. My command chief and I would get in a car and not tell anyone where we were going. We would drive somewhere throughout the wing and go talk to airmen. And I want to hear the feedback. I want the real feedback. And just hear from them directly. And they appreciated the interest we took in their job and what they were doing. We want to put systems in your hands that make it as easy as possible to do your job. Anyone can have a good idea. And quite honestly, our youngest airmen usually have some of the best ideas. As a fighter pilot, you have to learn to think very quickly. And you have to be able to think ahead of the airplane. You have to think about what's going to happen next. And so I think that has truly prepared me to be ready for the unknown. I think a lot of our ceremonies and our rituals are so important because they help us understand our heritage. And it instills that pride and pride is a powerful emotion. We will continue to be the world's greatest Air Force. And our job at Air Force Recruiting Service is to ensure that we attract America's best and brightest to remain the most powerful Air Force in the world. When people are proud of the organization that they are part of, they will work so hard to continue that incredible legacy.